guys welcome back to my channel i hope your weekend is off to a lovely start today i have an unboxing video for you and if you watched my last upload about the future of my youtube channel and some of the things that i've been struggling with i did mention that i'm going to slowly be whittling down the number of unboxings on this channel especially beginning in the new year i'm going to talk a little bit more about that at the very end of this video if you're curious but i am excited to share with you all today the Disney subscription box company that I have been with the longest. I've been subscribing to Magic at Your Door for over two years and I have not only my latest monthly box which has been uh, recently upgraded and I'm very excited to see what's in here but I also have this little kind of mini box called A Touch of Magic which is a new product rollout from the folks at Magic at Your Door that is a much lower price point and a nice way to get some magical Disney merch delivered to your door for a little lower financial investment so I'm excited to sort of check out the uh, the inaugural touch of magic box as well as always I will leave a link to magic at your doors website and social media channels down in my description box as well as a coupon code to save $10 off your first monthly magic box should you choose to uh, check out this company and without further ado I'm gonna jump into my big box here and I noticed that it's got a little Thanksgiving uh, theme to it dude the box has a little pilgrim hat and he's holding an acorn so I love a little festive touch here and there I have already used a little knife actually scissors to to open my box but I haven't looked inside yet here's my first look so on the top you've got the monthly newsletter which includes a color-coded merchandise pricing chart as well as various announcements of various things that are happening in magic at your door land and I will also remove the uh, crap ton of packing confetti that is sitting on the top just waiting to, to drive me crazy and get into my pet's hair and get into my carpet and clog my vacuum cleaner and drive my spouse insane, etc. And now that that stuff is out of the way, I'm getting my first kind of real look at the contents of my box and ooh, it looks like it's gonna be a, kind of a fancy one. I see a gym shore and a bag, like right out of the gate, so. Holy moly, Magic at Your Door recently went through a little bit of an upgrade in terms of the, the quality of the sort of hero items that they're providing in their monthly magic box. If you want to choose to, to opt into the sort of quality versus quantity version of this box, and I think that's what we have this month. So I'm going to just go right for the jugular. I'm going to go for the bag. Holy cow, holy cow. This looks like it might be... Yes, I, it's Snow White themed. This is a Snow White themed... Uh, mini lounge fly backpack purse, back backpack purse. It's kind of a strange shape. I don't have any bags that are this shape, but it's kind of like a um, it's like a purse. It's like a satchel, but it's got the um the backpack straps on it. So I guess it's a like a little like half sized mini backpack. This is cute. I I've never had one that's this shape before. But obviously it is Snow White themed. Snow White is one of my top two favorite Disney princesses and it's gorgeous. The, uh, the design of the bag is really modeled after the colors and design of her dress and then you've got the cute little hair bow on the top and then this flap opens up. Oh yeah, so it is kind of like a purse. There's a zipper on the top. You can peek inside. Oh, look how cute inside. There's um, some lining on the fabric, but it's like the seven dwarves are on the, the fabric lining. That's pretty cool. Ooh, I'm also seeing the famous and eagerly anticipated monthly silver pouch from Magic at Your Door, so I'm gonna set this aside for later. But I think there's a fair amount of room in here. I like that there's a little zipper pouch inside. And then speaking of zipper pouches, when you close this up, there is also a zipper pouch on the front. There's the Disney Lounge Fly uh, logo tag. And then look at the, um, the zipper charm. It's a little poisoned apple. So you open it up and inside you can stash, oh, this is a little bit smaller, you can stash a few more things. This is cool. I haven't seen this bag design, at least not in person yet. So I am pretty stoked about this. I can definitely see myself wearing this um, in the Disney parks or for like a cosplay or a Disney bound. The retail price on this bag is $75. Lounge fly does not mess around. So this is a pretty hefty item. I would not be surprised if this is like the most expensive item in my box by far. Um, but I really like it. This whole Snow White thing is, is very me. So I'm pumped about this. Really fun kind of starring item of my box. And now I'm going to go straight for the other item which immediately jumped out at me, which is this box, which is a Disney Showcase uh, Jim Shore box. They probably look familiar to some of you. I, I do love the beautiful Jim Shore figures and 
Um, I've been fortunate to um, unbox a lot of them lately, but this one is, oh my goodness. Uh, this is one that I actually haven't noticed before, but it's one of my favorite characters. I'm gonna open this up. Uh, maybe I might be able to get this open. Okay, that was kind of tricky. Let me open this up and see. i find the end of the tape here. Dust is like flying. Ugh. Styrofoam dust is in my nose. Okay. Here we go. Oh, this is lovely. This is a nice size, too. This is actually larger than um, I thought it was going to be, but it's one of my other favorite, favorite Disney characters. Probably like the character of 2019 for me, and that is Tinkerbell from Peter Pan, but it's not just any old Tinkerbell. It is Tinkerbell for fall. This is autumnal Tink, autumnal Tinkerbell. So she is standing with her little pixie shoes on an autumn leaf, and then there's autumn colors around the base of the statue, and then she's holding a little acorn, which is just so, so adorable. And then she's got her beautiful wings. I'm really glad that they weren't damaged because they're actually quite delicate. This is a gorgeous figurine, and I've got a little, tink uh, situation on my um, on my filing cabinet back there, so I'm gonna add this to my background until I transition over to my Christmas decor, which um, will probably be happening pretty soon. But oh, I really love this. I do love the Jim Shore figures. I'm gonna downsize a lot, but I think I'm gonna be keeping most of my Jim Shores because they're just, they're really special. I'm actually gonna do this right now. I'm gonna remove my awesome Zootopia Jim Shore, which I love, by the way. This was a gift from my friend Rowan over at the Disney Damsels, and I'm gonna replace it with a Tinkerbell. And for now, for at least, you know, the next week or so, that whole filing cabinet is now, it's now Peter Pan and Tinkerbell themed. So, woohoo, yay for theming. Sorry, Nick and Judy, I still love you both. Just checking out the box for the price tag real quick. This says fall Tinkerbell, $48. So almost a $50 item. So we're almost at like 120, I think we're at $123 between the bag and the Tinkerbell statue. I think now I'm just seeing one more item plus my silver pouch. So two more items in my, uh, in my big box. And oh, I love this. So this is a package of sticky notes um, after my all time favorite uh, Disney attraction, which is Splash Mountain. Um, I've actually seen this in the parks and I did not buy it because of the price. The price like boggled my little brain. Um, this is a $10 pack of sticky notes and as gorgeous as they are, I just like, I can't do that. I'm glad Magic Your Door did it for me because I could never pay $10 for 20 times for 80 sticky notes, like that's insane. But look at how great they are. So you've got Br'er Rabbit, Mr. Bluebird. This one says, to the laughing place. And then you've got a splash for Splash Mountain. I really do love Disney stationery, sticky notes, page flags. I use these for obviously making notes to myself, but also for doing my planning, my planning situation, my, you know, using my planners and, and uh, day keepers and things. So I will totally use these um, and I won't have to feel guilty about it now because <laughs> I didn't fork over the $10 bill myself, but they really are gorgeous. So I'm, I'm happy with this item for sure. And finally, last but not least in my fancy box this month, I have my silver pouch. I'm gonna take out the, uh, oh. <laughs> Of course. Um, I'm gonna take out of my silver pouch something else that is Splash Mountain themed. It is the Disney Wishables Br'er Rabbit Plush. I already have this. Um, so this will go in a giveaway or it'll it'll go in a something. It's gonna be a something. Um, but it's just so stinking cute. I really do love these Wishables. They didn't know that I already had this. Um, but I love the Wishables. They're soft, they're cuddly, they have stars in their eyes, and, um, and, and Splash Mountain, like I said, is my favorite attraction. So very well matched to me. So well matched, in fact, that I already have it. The retail price on these tiny little Wishables plush, by the way, is $10, which is expensive for a plush this big but you know it is what it is folks so another ten dollar item in this month's box if i'm doing the math correctly in my brain i think that brings the total retail value of my big magic box this month to 143 dollars retail value and i believe the box itself is about 125 dollars including shipping plus you can save ten dollars if you use my coupon code so you get um, a good value great curation shipping's included and um yeah i mean I love everything. I have zero complaints about this whatsoever. All this stuff is super me and um, and it's like 
kind of like current high-end awesome products. Which now brings me to this box, box number two of this video. There's only two, don't worry. There's not more than that. And this is a new box that they have rolled out. I think it's about $50-ish. Um, so a much lower price point than the monthly magic box. The trick with this one is that you don't get to pick your preferences. It's like pure mystery and surprise. So I actually kind of like stuff like that because I'm swimming in Disney stuff anyway and it's just fun to be surprised sometimes. Um, but yeah, this is a new thing that you can order on their website. My coupon code I don't think works for this one because the price point is so much lower. Um, but yeah, let's open it up. It's called A Touch of Magic. It's just a touch, not a bad touch, a good touch. And it says on the front, A Touch of Magic, Disney Kitty, let a touch of magic begin. So, sounds like a plan. Okay, so opening it up, first thing I'm seeing is also the, uh, the newsletter. I'm not sure if this is different or the same as the big box newsletter. I'm assuming it's the same. So, I'll set this aside. And more packing confetti, just what I always wanted. Truly, this this is a touch of magic right here. Get it away from me, blah! And here is my real first look that is mostly unobstructed now by evil packing confetti. And I'm actually seeing, believe it or not, another Jim Shore Disney Showcase box. So I'm getting two Jim Shores in one day. Holy smokes, what is happening in the world? And I can actually, this has plastic on it, I can actually see what it is. Uh, and, and I love this actually. This is um, from Fantasia, the little baby Pegasus figurine. I did not get to choose my preferences for this box, but I would totally have loved to have this in a box where I did choose my preferences because he's just so stinking cute. Oh my goodness. Oh, so it's one of the kind of miniature baby little Jim Shores. The retail price is $17. But look at how adorable he is. He actually looks kind of pissed off, but like super cute, his little wings. And then you've got the little Jim Shore embellishments. I just love this. I'm, I've got a little kind of rapidly growing Jim Shore collection. Um, and of all the things in my Disney collection that I downsized, like I said a moment ago, I, I think I'm keeping my Jim Shores because they're just, they're just beautiful and they're timeless. And the remaining contents of my Touch of Magic box is all kind of in one, they're all kind of in one stack here. So let's see what we've got. Oh, this is pretty. I have a pouch and I have a really pretty set of dish towels. Um, and I don't always love Disney dish towels, but I really like these. I'll keep these and use these because I am just generally a fan of like the more muted colors. It matches our house. And this is also kind of like a nice sophisticated grown-up design. So let me give you a close-up. So we have a magical black and white and gold embroidered Cinderella castle. And it says, most magical place on earth in, in embroidery at the bottom. And then on the second towel, you've got more of the same castle and it says, where your dreams come true. These are really nice. I actually, I, I don't love Disney dish towels in general because I mean it's dish towels, but these would, these would look good in my kitchen. So I'm a fan, very nice surprise. There is no price on this item and I have no idea what these retail for in the parks, but if I had to guess, just having looked at lots of Disney merch in my life, I'm guessing this is like a $25 item. Like if I picked this up and the price tag said $24.99, I'd be like, yeah, that's a Disney price for, for a pair of dish towels. So that's my guess. And finally, from my little touch of magic box, I have this silver pouch. Love me the magic at your door. Signature silver pouch. And inside, there's more packing confetti. And there's also, oh, these are nice. This is a set of two pens. They kind of match the, uh, the dish towel set. And they're little um, clickable, clickable ballpoint pens. Well, let me just get close. They have that kind of same like fancy home goods, like a little more sophisticated, not too kiddie-ish uh, design. I love pens and stationery, so I'll totally use these. I like practical things in life. Um, so these are fun. And <laughs> look at the price tag on this set of two pens, $17. What, what? I mean, I wouldn't pay that for a set of pens, but you know, it's Disney and <laughs> We all know how Disney prices can be. They are nice though. Let me just pull it out really quick. Uh, just kidding, I can't even get them out. I'll have to take a scissors to this <laughs> later when I'm not filming, but they look very nice in their packaging, so there you go. So quickly here from my brain, we have $17 for pens, 
$17 for Pegasus, that's $34, plus the dish towel, which I'm gonna say is like between $20 and $25. So total, that would be a value of like $54 to $59 for a $50 box, including shipping. So you still get a little bit more than the total retail value of the items. It's not as expensive as the big monthly box, but it is a surprise, so I hope you like surprises. I like surprises, I think that's a lot of fun. Personally, I know I prefer something that's a little bit more high-end and she-she and customizable, but that's just me. But all of your Magic at Your Door subscription options are listed on their website, which I have linked to down below, as per usual. That is all for the unboxing portion of this video. I do wanna just comment briefly on the video I uploaded earlier this week on Tuesday about uh, kind of my general life update and the struggle I've been having with like Disney collecting and materialism and the wastefulness of it all so I just want to reiterate that going forward on this channel probably starting January ish I'll be doing I'm not gonna say no Disney unboxings but I'm gonna be doing fewer of them because I just need to make the stuff in my life more manageable. But that doesn't mean I don't love Magic at Your Door and Bibbidi Bobby Boxes and, and all these great companies that bring park products to people. It's just a personal lifestyle choice that I have to make. It will be forthcoming on this channel. New types of content will be coming soon and that will happen mostly in the new year. Just wanted to address it in case anyone is confused. And by the way, if you missed my highly dramatic life update video, I'll link to that in my description box as well. Thanks so much for watching everybody i hope you have a great weekend leave a comment down below let me know what your favorite item that i unboxed today was leave your comments on the new a touch of magic offering from magic at your door love to read your comments as always i'll be back quite soon i do have more videos in the pipeline for you until then have a magical day and i will see you real soon bye guys Mwah.